This computational fluid dynamic animation was conducted to show that the nozzle placement could improve the evaporation rate of the injection fluid in a refinery application. The first case indicates that five nozzles are located on one side of the ductwork, while case two indicates that two of the nozzles are moved to the opposite wall, plus a little bit further downstream from the original injection point. The following animations show the gas velocity contours and the animated path lines of the gas velocity. All these animations are shown for the final solution with three nozzles located on one wall and two nozzles mounted on the opposite wall. Temperature contours and visualization of the spray plumes are helpful to understand how much of the spray is in contact with the process stream. Particle tracking of the process stream is also helpful to visualize the temperature reductions. The goal of this study was to achieve as much evaporation prior to the gas stream changing direction at the end of the ductwork. The first case study resulted in 92.2% evaporation, while the replacement of the injectors of the second study resulted in 99.3% evaporation with hardly any wall contact of the droplets. Industry would have used the rule of thumb that 10 to 20 pipe diameters of straight length will be sufficient for achieving the desired cooling or mixing. 10 to 20 pipe diameters will not help in selecting the optimum nozzle placement. We have found that marrying our nozzle data with the computational fluid dynamics program enables us to challenge the rules of thumb that have been used throughout industry.